When somebody loses a tooth, it's a pretty traumatic experience, especially if it's in the aesthetic area where people can see. Today we can place implants into that area, which is nothing more than placing a metal root-like structure into the bone, and then once it heals and integrates, or if the implant is in firm enough to begin with, we can put an, a crown on that tooth, which is the tooth replacement that the patient sees immediately. And that's a great service to be able to provide for a patient. The placement of dental implants has evolved significantly over the past 20 and 30 years. We used to have to place implants where there was bone. Now with the technology that we have, we can actually see where the bone is, make some determinations whether we have to do some additional grafting or not, which is to rebuild lost bony structures from the loss of teeth, and place those implants exactly where they belong so the tooth replacement looks like the patient's previous identical tooth. Patients often ask, once they have a dental implant, how long is it gonna take for that tooth to be restored? Very good question, and it depends. It depends on the anchorage of that implant at the time of placement, the condition and the health of the patient to begin with. More often than not, we can place the implant and the restoration the same day. Sometimes we have to wait for that implant to integrate, and again, that's gonna depend again on the patient, uh, their ability to heal, the quality of bone that they have, and other factors like that.